It's our last week already of marketing, and we're going to start with digital marketing. Now, this is a very high-level, brief introduction to digital marketing. I recommend that you take a full-blown course on digital marketing because there's so much to learn and know about it, and it's constantly changing. Then we're also going to look at location. Uh, if you've ever been uh, around a real estate agent, one of their favorite sayings is location, location, location. It's, uh, it means a lot and can have a huge impact on not only your customers and can they reach you, are you conveniently located, are you accessible to them, but also it, it the location affects how your employees work in that environment, how efficient they are in serving customers or providing services. So we're going to look at how you scout out a location. How, what are some of the things you ought to be considering when you're choosing a location? We'll also look at immigrant entrepreneurship and the impact it has on the national economy all the way down to the local economy and all the jobs and community um, that those entrepreneurs bring to their area. We'll also look at the common traits that immigrant entrepreneurs share and the unique challenges that they face as business owners. So the assigned assignments this week is a discussion board on location and quiz number four. So the discussion board on location, I want you to go out and find two business locations. One that you think is really great and one that you think is not so hot. Tell me why. Why is that a great location or why is it not? And then a little bit of an extra credit bonus Take a picture, upload that with your assignment for a couple of extra credit points because a picture is worth a thousand words and I'll be able to see exactly what you're talking about with those pictures. The quiz is meant to get you ready for unit three exam, which is all on marketing and location, immigrant entrepreneur. Then you'll also have a marketing plan rough draft that is due. This gives you a chance to articulate your marketing philosophy. How are you going to reach your target market? What is your target market? How are you going to segment? Using last week's discussion board case study gave you practice for you to do this on your own. And the class is designed for you to give me a rough draft of this marketing plan so that I can give you feedback that you can incorporate into your final business plan that's due in a couple of weeks. Then you'll sit for unit three exam. Again, that just covers a marketing location and immigrant entrepreneurship. So it follows the same format uh, with some multiple choice, uh, true, false, short answer questions. So that will conclude and wrap up our unit three. Uh, content and uh, good luck on that exam and with your marketing plan rough drafts.